Hello everyone, welcome back to Fable Heyman Baldur's Gate 3. Fabe continues his dark pursuit of knowledge. Starting off in camp. Today we'll be in the Druid's Grove quite a lot, so there will this will probably be a very dialogue heavy episode, but I will do my best to keep it rolling. But before that, we're in camp because there's a traveler's chest here, which I forgot existed. This chest has infinite capacity, I have been informed, and this is from the Deluxe Edition, which anyone who purchased the game during DLC possesses. I believe these items will have, yes, references to Divinity Original Sen 2. Needle of the Outlaw Rogue. We can throw this? Hmm. The Bike One of the Sea Beast, the Cape of the Red Prince, and of course a loot. Look how fancy that is. It's too fancy for Fabe. I am but a humble sage and scholar. Oh, what was this? No, oh, I just get to keep it. And in here is... Why is it in this weird formation? Some potions. Increase your strength to 21. Wow. Oh, hey, potion of animal speak. I get a... It's a one and done, but... Okay, we'll take this. Uh, can I put these back in here? I can't. Nice, 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 nice. I don't need them. It's fine. Bewildering Adventurer's Pack. So technically I can keep this around with me, right? Hmm. Can I store my potions in here? That would make sense. I would like that. I have a lot of them, as you can see. I also did a bit of, uh, thievery. Uh, before this episode. And, um, Starion has done well. We have stolen pretty much everything of value, including something that I'm going to test out. The Potion of Invisibility. You may already know what I'm about to test, but uh, hopefully it'll be exciting either way. I also noticed that uh, you can track the approval of your companions. And let's just say no one is particularly fond of me. So that could be concerning. Ahead. <laughs> a, a concerning trend already taking place. But let's get back to the Druid's Grove today and discern what's going on. Now, so far, I've given a bit of a contrarian response. I sympathized with the oh, refugees, break. of course, saying that I would speak to the lead, the druid currently in charge. Hey, Aaron, I stole your crap. I hope you don't mind. You didn't like refresh or anything, did you? Need anything else? Oh, yeah. Of course. But please remember. You're not the only one in need. Are you sure? I don't believe he has really refreshed. Okay, that's fine. I mean, I could steal these to, you know, learn, but... Ah, whatever. Sylvanas be with you. Yep. Great. Uh, so I sympathized with the refugees a little bit, and I told this guy that, you know, I understand why the, the grove is locking down, but we'll learn the full extent of Thabe's feelings today, I am sure. We've known enough grief this ten-day traveler. Great. Don't be the cause of more. Mm, we'll see how I feel about that. Sure. Now, there is a... Ooh, there's another merchant in here. I might have some more thievery to do. A case of gentle larceny. Now, here is another... Look who's here. It's me. What do you... What, what do you want? The Blade of Frontiers. What a thrill for the children. <laughs> They're tough kids. Smart, too. The future's in good hands. Is it? So that's Will. He is a recruitable Go companion. On. Give me a best shot. Not bad. Again. Are you sure it's not bad? You kind of just. I can't do it. I'm not like you. Umi. I don't need you to be like me. You just have to buy enough time to run. Come on. I believe in you. You can do this. Hmm. Tis good advice. You do well to listen. Hmm. You're on the right path, Umi. Go on now. Practice what you've learned. Hello, well Will. Met. The Blade of Frontiers at your... The man's smile bends downward. And his thoughts become yours. 
You are the blade of frontiers racing through the wastes of Avernus. Just ahead, a diabolical figure, red skin, single curled horn, blazes with flame, bloodied great axe hell. <sighs> Hell's great fires. You were on the ship. I was, yes. We mm. both carry parasites. Doomed to shed our skin and become a lithid, or so the stories go. But we haven't sprouted any tentacles. Not yet, anyway. Could just be good luck. I'm not so... Your minds collide once more. Will chases the fiend ignited with rancor. She is an infernal war devil. A threat to the living. Evil incarnate. Shit! You saw her. Advocatus Diaboli. Advocatus Diaboli. A devil's advocate. A champion in the blood war between diabolical forces and demons. Hey, hit that intelligence check. Alrighty. Well, do you think she'll bring the blood war to Faerun? That would be amusing to watch. That ship sailed the sticks already. All I can hope for is to limit the damage. Her name is Karlak. An archdevil soldier I swore on my good eye to kill. I tracked her through the hells to the Mind Flayer ship. But the damned Elithids infected me before I could end her. She's out there now, preying on the innocent. I don't kill her. She'll leave behind nothing but a trail of corpses. Are you sure? Well. <laughs> I don't. Okay, so Will has been rewritten since early access. I did not like him in early access. He's kind of a goody goody two shoe, which, um, you know, we sit far more on the neutral fence. Uh, so we are probably going to clash with personality-wise. And I also don't need him. Although he could be fun. Well, um, do we want to partner up? Just so you know, my first duty is Karlak. I'm oath-bound to go after her. But I won't deny this infection is bothersome. I accept your invitation. Great, go sit in camp. And You'll do need to make room if you want to partner up, though. Still... When the time comes, call for the blade. I won't be long to answer. Great. A splendid plan. We'll talk more there. So Will could be an interesting character. His patron is very involved in the story. So he is the second character whose class affects his story heavily, but not only his class, his subclass as well. Step, parry, strike, damn it! It's just not landing. Bro. <laughs> You'd better surrender. That target's a far better fighter. You have a better way? Because I'm all ears. We need to be ready for a fight. But I'm useless with a sword. Well? Hmm. I guess we'll use our insight, because I don't have any athletics. No wonder you're struggling. You've no balance. Space your feet farther apart. A ten. How are we going to do? I think this is a wisdom check. Yeah. Mailed it. Off to a good start today. I'll, I'll try and brace them better. Um, like so. Step, brace, parry, swing. Yes. You really know what you're doing. Uh, found this by the road. Bet you'll put it to good use. Oh, thanks. Oh, one last thing. Don't shut out your moves like that. It spoils the surprise for your foes. Oh, yes. I'll bite my tongue when the time comes. Great. Good work. Hopefully, it's just the goblins we have to worry about. Yeah. The druids are treating us like vermin. But I'll keep at it. Thank you. That's certainly no foreshadowing. Let's have a look. So that inspired Lazel. Speaking of uh, inspiring Lazel. Part of the reason we're here, you know, besides to sell items, we got a battle axe, is to speak with Zoro here, who is the person who saw another Githyanki. So let us watch how uh, Lazel <laughs> initiates this interrogation. By Mordai's eyes, another one. My friend's blood not enough. Come to rip me open too. In Kresh Kalir, a formal greeting begins with a bow. Is this monster with you? Oh, yes. And I suggest you do as she says.
Lower. <laughs> uh, she is serious. You'd better get on your knees. Oh. This must feel like. Saw another gift. Where? On the road to Baldur's Gate, N near the mountain pass. S saw us, for we saw it. Jammed its blade through Yul's belly. Straight to the other side. No twisting. Kin must have been in a hurry. The map. Show me. Just feel quite excessive for protocol. Up. You can keep your innards. Oh, you're not going to eviscerate him. I was hoping for a show. Cool your blood. I'll indulge you soon enough. <laughs> uh, it's always fun watching them. The locals prove compliant. A useful trait. I warned you, didn't I? You ought to reconsider keeping her around before she causes real trouble. Hmm. Well. What? Hmm. Should I ask her if she plans on being... rough with everyone we meet? Now, ah, what comes next? The tea sling was clear. If there are Githyanki west of here, that must be our objective. Purification cannot wait. What do you mean, purification? The crash holds the Zathisk. It will cleanse us of the parasite. Oh, convenient. By covenant, I can say no more. Okay. Sounds good to me. Can I check to see if that increased approval rate? It kind of was bug like bugging out in the top corner. Oh, look, a combat log. Uh, I was hoping for a dialogue log. Was, is that a thing? Maybe. Maybe only in dialogue? I mean, I know it's a thing. I just don't know how to find it. Okay, whatever. Hey, it's a locked door. Keep a blade close. Good news. I have a lock picker. A very efficient lock picker. I'm pretty sure with this, I literally cannot fail. Oh, and I got a natural 20 anyway. <laughs> okay. What to do? Like I said, today's rolls are off to a great start. This oh. place is off limits. Leave. Um. Well. Hmm. I'm afraid I can't. We deceived someone a tiefling earlier. I'll just keep deceiving people. I think this is a charisma check, which we're not great at, but we also have no penalties to it, so. Wow, what a good day so far. I should go buy a lottery ticket. But Zevlor said I... Damn it! Figured it was a pity post anyway. Yep. Do what you gotta do. Sorry if I don't show you around. I'd just fall back down. Legs are as steady as a falls. Bloody potion! I asked her if she needed up, sorry. Well... Mm, sounds like it was quite the dodgy brew. No! I'm just an idiot. Can't argue that. I wanted an edge against the goblins, and I got it. I'm as strong as a bugbear. And fearless. But the old lady, she warned me of side effects. Should have listened. Now I'm stuck guarding crates. Hmm. Strong brews sometimes have lasting effects. You should prepare for the worst. What? N no. No, she, she said it wouldn't be permanent. It can't be. It'll wear off soon. It has to. Well, if this old lady is who I think it is, using my experience from early access, of course, it won't. Careful. <laughs> well, anyway. Ooh, this isn't stealing. I thought it would be because the door was stealing. It was all red. Well, anyway, if you're not going to stop me, I'll just help myself to all of it. The cabinet key. A small, simple key, like the ones made for closets and cabinets. Found in a chest in the Emerald Grove. I wonder what that's for. 
soul coins. Oh. The next 50 pages appear to be a painstakingly written legal document in Infernal. Oh, okay. That's great. Come the on, cheese. Now, I believe I can help her. Uh, if I'm interested in such a thing. Supply log is scrawled and underlined on the inside cover. The dirt stained pages that follows track the storage and use of food and medical equipment. Mm, they are nearly depleted. Unsurprising. I don't particularly want to loot everything here. Wait. Nothing. Oh. Is there a way through here? So I can move stuff, right? You can move stuff. There's no time to waste. Assume nothing. Maybe. <laughs> Just move it all at once. Oh, wait a minute. Wait, 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 wait. So, we're traveling oh. with the famed Blade of Frontiers. I feel safer already. Eh. Great. Bazel. I don't know why he felt the need to comment that, but here we are. I actually don't know if I can do this. Like, there are some things I know. Oh, ho, ho. cool. Where am I? But this is not one of them. Ooh, a silver ingots. Why is Lazelle looting all this? I should be looting all this. This is mine. Need something? No, you're just in my way. What's that? Hey. What's next? I have no strength. Can you move this? What is that? A malnourished torch stalk. That's not going to explode, is it? That doesn't sound <gasps> particularly good. <laughs> uh, I believe those are in the That'd underdark. Worth a look. The light on my feet. Ooh. Hi. Prisoner. A stone door. Hello? An underground path. I feel like I'm doing this in the wrong order, but since we're here... Glowing eyes are rarely a good sign. <laughs> Fucking ow! Shut it! Boss is with you for talking that way! God damn it. You will not rest it enough. Now. Forward. Just because Did I'm. Some bleeding hearts show up uh -oh. to save the druid. I'll cut you to pieces. I think I'm still being shot. Kill him. I am. What the fuck? What is this? Wow. Um. Hmm. Okay. Well, let's get Shadowheart up, because she's the only one that can fucking heal on this team. We're in mud, which isn't a great start. Oh, that was my action. Can I try and hide? Remember when I said I hadn't been here before? Survival is all that matters. Is it? All right, I think I'm gonna have to grease here. Cause I could hit everybody. Or not. <laughs> Wonder if the gods are watching me. Well, if they are, they're probably disappointed. Just like I am. My injuries need tending. Yeah, and I'll do my best. Good miss. I'm counting on this. Okay. Um, right. Potion of healing. That should have been a bonus action. Why do I not have an action? Got to move. I don't know. Is it because I just got up? I will ascend. Mm-hmm.
Do you know anything about this? Well, we're going to find out. Okay, we have psionics, precision attack. Oh, yes, this is because of all of our, our stuff. I wonder if I could push him down there and if it's worth it. 55%. Nailed it. I'm going to have to action search. We're just going to use all of our resources here because of the bad start. All right. Did I change this? Oh, I turned it off. Okay. I should have I should have known that. <laughs> the rune was right there. Okay, can I hide? Into the shadows. No, I cannot. But I do have two bonus actions, so I can try again. I think it was here. What is that? Water barrel? Oh. I'll try again. See me? Oh, ho, ho, ho. Well done, Astarian. Rogue's OP. Blood comes easy these days. Astarian also has the, um... Oh. I can guarantee his death if I use a, a level 2 thing. Do I want to, though? What else can I do? I'm going to. Like I said, we're using all of our resources. It's fine. Ooh. It's four. What do they do? 44 plus four force. He's dealing two to five. Okay, fine. I have to do it. I don't have to, but... He would have lived if I didn't. You saw it. All right. I think we're good. I think we survived by the skin of my teeth. one of those things. No time to waste. Including out of range. This is this an action? Now oh, whatever. Just shoot it. Miss Battlemaster. Time for a new approach. On my way. You are going to sneak attack. Or attempt to anyway. Advantage? Rogue's OP. Holy own. shit. Okay. You are unconscious. Can I help you? A great axe. Um, will this help? No. Target cannot be helped. Can you fix this? Question. Is he unconscious because he's, like, dead? Or is he unconscious because he's debuffed? Because I'll give him a touch. Level one touch. Oh. Still alive. So that's progress. Hi. Who are you? Oh, thank you, thank you. I thought I was going to die down here. Why were you down here? Hmm. <laughs> I'm surprised the goblins didn't gut you on sight. Why didn't they? They were asking questions about a weapon. I'm intrigued. I told them the only weapons here are the ones the foul bloods brought. I must tell the others what happened. I step careful. There are traps in these tunnels. And thank you again. Yeah, I found one. Can I just technically help the druids? Oh. I'm not too keen on that. A bullywug trumpet. With haste. Okay. Sure. Uh, if there are traps in this place, I'm out of short rest. No one back home will ever believe We, this. I, should 100% long rest. I use spells. We're dying. It's long rest time. 
Hi, Gail. I will. Do you guys have feelings? Do we need to talk about our feelings? Why is there a vendor here? Oh, Withers wants to talk about his feelings. Okay. Hey, Withers. Let's chat. What are we chatting about? Save real quick. Not this one. Nor this one. And this one are less worthy still. Who? Uh. <laughs> less worthy still. More riddles from a resident jester. I riddle thee not. I speak only what requires telling. Um. Beyond mortal realms, there doth exist an amalgamation of spirits akin to thine own, ensnared by the treacherous cult of the Absolute, felled in its name. They bear great discontentment with their destiny. Um. For a mere pittance of coin, I might summon the worthiest among them to lend aid to thy undertaking. Oh, is this... Is this the hirelings? Will these hirelings join me willingly? Most willingly, forsooth. <laughs> Their passions doth run deep for what hath been wrought upon them. Hmm. Okay, you think I can trust them? Suspicion always haunts the guilty mind. My services are all that I can proffer thee. What thou wilt do with them is for thee to undertake. I see. So, I would like to talk about hirelings. Very well. Oh. All right, I'm leaving. Uh, so this was a feature in Divinity Original Sin 2 as well. And basically, these are classes. They're char NPC characters that you can bring in if you don't have an origin character that fulfills a role you want. So we could hire just, like, for example, we could hire a paladin to be our charisma character slash frontliner. We could hire whatever we want. There's one for each of the 12 uh, classes. But I think, are they pre-built characters? I don't know. I just know you can't romance them. <laughs> I don't think, anyway. Finally, some good fortune. Come morning, we know what to do. We do. Oh, right. I can't wait to get this thing out of my head. So, what will come next for you once this is all over? Head to Baldur's Gate. Someone's waiting for me. Oh, yeah? Let a girl have some secrets. Oh. Was there anything else? Uh, she will be major pissed if I upset, if I do not use, or excuse me, if I fail this connection. Even if I succeed. Uh, how are you feeling? The same. These parasites are proving suspiciously benign. I agree. But suppose I turn. What would you do? <laughs> there are some people into this. Um. Well, no hesitations. I just end your misery. Hmm. Honestly, I wouldn't be against leaving her tied up while hunted for your cure. I have a feeling she's not going to like this. But maybe I could. Hypothetical. Really? I'd just kill you. Say. Anyway, get some rest. Try not to dream about tying me up. Oh, I'm sure people have done that for me. Hi, Lazel. Galek. I remember who I was in Kreshkalea. And what? I was hungry to face my first geek. My sword pined for their blood. Would that I were doing battle up there, among the tears. The tears of Saloon, you mean? Yes. Rocky bodies named after a false goddess. Next time you're able, look to the sky. Watch the moon cross it. The tears follow behind it. Rocky bodies tumbling through the sea of night. One of them is my crash. Clear. Huh. Our all get Yankee from the tears. Your curiosity is to be commended. My only good trick. Yankee are hatched in creches all throughout realm space. Clear is one of many. 
It's there I first saw a Kithrak mount a red dragon. Where I slit my cousin's throats at the Vash's command. But enough of this. You are wasting your resting time. Come dawn, we resume our search for a crash. Okay. Fair enough. I was hoping to get some approval out of them before they go mad. Will wants to talk about his feelings as well, but we're going to prioritize Asterion. I think you can actually, like if you talk to so many people, you can't talk to more. Uh, so we should prioritize the people that, that I like. You know, I've been thinking. About? Reflecting on what tomorrow might bring when we arrive at this gith crash. I have low when expectations. Find out how to bring the worm under control. Will this little adventure of ours be over? Hmm. What? Will you miss me? <laughs> Why not? Are you flirting with me You've right been now? You've to the hells and back. Survived the crash. Survived everything that's followed. I'm not easily impressed by people, but you're stronger than I gave you credit for. Aw, thank you. <laughs> Oh, and here I thought you didn't like me. You have your charms more than you think. I failed an insight check. Hmm. Well, hmm. Watch yourself, Astarian. Oh, you're no fun. Sleep tight. I'll see you later. I'm sure. That didn't sound reassuring at all. <laughs> I mean, I do want to get to know him better, but that sounded suggestive, and I'm not talking about the suggestive way. I'm just talking about the how do I keep you as my master lock picker and picket pocket picker. A tingle runs through your head and down to your feet. I will. <sighs> there it is. That shiver. Our little brain worms have made fast friends, it would seem. Faster than we are. How do you feel? Fine. Hmm. Surprisingly fine. <laughs> Surprising is just the word, isn't it? Before the Illithid's unscheduled surgery, I'd felled hundreds of beasts and a fair few fiends. The tadpoles weakened me, suppressed greater talents, but beyond that, I've showed no signs of turning. No nausea, no pain, not even a hot flash. Wait, the the temple has suppressed you? Hmm. Well, something special about us, or at the very least, about our temples. Indeed. Perhaps the worm's vat was poisoned. Perhaps we're uncommonly fit. Or perhaps the tadpoles are merely on holiday. We could conjecture all night. I suppose the why doesn't matter so much as the what next. True. And that answer is plain as the horns on a war devil's head. We get these things out. Let's get some rest. Dawn comes sooner than we think. Okay. Well, that leaves one. Uh, he doesn't have a thingy, but you have a word to say, Gale? I've known a few warlocks in my time. Talented. Of course, they're sometimes too eager to listen to the devils on their shoulders. <laughs> Comes with the territory, unfortunately. Hmm. Okay. That was just his opinion about uh, the blade. Alrighty. I suspect something is going to happen tonight. Something peculiar. Surprising. Or not. <laughs> Act of the exploration. So, we're rummaging through. I believe we'll have a star in lead. If there is indeed traps throughout the tunnel. Something like that. Hmm. Should I have... You know what? Let's detach a star in. Let's get a star in all super sneaky. Up. Oh. Something succeeded. Where is it? Uh, 
Hmm. You think it will see me no matter what? But also, this will probably explode, won't it? Eh. That's what quick saving is for. Let's find out. Ooh. Wow. Okay. They didn't see me. Or didn't feel like shooting me this time. Not sure which one, to be honest. I can only say that I'm grateful. Medium toughness. A trap. Oh. Someone doesn't like visitors. Hold up. How do I disarm? Here we go. Uh, do I need to get Shadowheart over here for guidance? Whatever comes, I'm ready. I'm I should be there. safe now that we've disarmed this. Or else just blow this up for fun. Alright. Let's have some fun. There we go. I rolled a three. Glad I brought her over here. I still actually would have met it by one, but no. Now we lock back. A 15. And a natural, tw that's two nat 20s in one episode. What are the chances? Nature Snare. What? This is a stop. It is. Huh. So this is more for monks than... If Fabe is hitting people with his staff, we have a whole bunch of other problems. Now... Looks like I can go this way, or I can go deeper still. I'm concerned that there were three statues here, but only two are turned off. Hmm. Suspicious. I don't see anything. All right, Astarian. In we go. Goblin tracks. Oh, you can practically smell the filth. No, oh, we have wound up on the outside of the grove. Interesting. Okay. Fair enough. That means I got to go to the other door. I think I know where that door leads, but we'll find out. Alrighty, in we go. Will this lead to where I think it does? The Enclave Library. Hello? Stay low. Traps. How considerate. Can I disarm this without being poisoned or whatever? Oh, the holy sh... What? A 30 difficulty check? I'd have to natch... I'd have to hit a 20 on that. To disarm it. Same for you? Wow. What on earth is back here that you need a bloody 30 trap? Oh. There is another option, maybe. <laughs> if it's poison, like most poison, I think they explode. Nope. Oh. Hmm. Do you freeze? No. Hmm. Can I? Ooh, that's an idea. Eager for battle. Can I put stuff on top of it? Alrighty, I went outside and grabbed some wooden crates, and our strong woman is gonna go. Aha! Ha 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 ha! Look at that! Isn't that beautiful? All right, what is in here? Something has to be in here, right? Something over there. Of course. Over where? 
Ooh. Let's go. I can't even see a lot to pick. Hmm. All's well that ends. Oh, not as bad as it could have. Not Let's even a lot to pick. Let's see. This means it needs like a the uh, a rune or something. Hmm. Okay. Well, I did my best. If I find something suspicious, Can't we'll be back. Down. I'll remember. Speaking of suspicious things, I was looking at the map here, and look what I found. The Rune of the Wolf. So. Oh, dear. It's mad. No, don't prone. No, no, no. No, 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 no. Back up, back up. Okay. Detach. Uh, use a tier one heal on her. Eager for battle into the shadows. Can I stealth through this? If Shadow Heart stays there and you stealth, will this work? Fuck. Run, 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 run. Consider me intrigued. It's fine. I need healing. Yeah. Ooh. Nailed it. <laughs> the charred key. A sin silver key held by a long dead corpse. Now where does this go? Wait, why are you glowing? Yeah, I perceived the statues. I saw them. Mostly because they were shooting stuff at me. One true way. Well, I mean now I have to go check. At least things have stayed interesting. All right, the slab is still close. So, time to press ahead. We'll find it eventually, I'm confident. Since I was too lazy to leave the cave, I thought I'd do some teleportation and uh I forgot to loot this guy. And this guy has the rapier. I was doing um a playthrough off camera with a sort and I found this. And wouldn't you know the rapier? I'm pretty sure is like the best weapon. The best finesse weapon in general early on. Anyway, I found it, no so I thought I'd show you oh, and make use of it. Time wasted. Back, back to the druids. Alrighty, we're back in the grove, so I thought I'd check out this merchant lady. You saw you fighting those slimy bastards. The goblins? Fancy a bowl? Best to fill your belly now while we still can. <laughs> a bowl of grey goo reminds me of home. You've been on hard times too, huh? It's all in the past. That doesn't mean it's behind us though, does it? Here, have more. We'll need every bit of strength to make it to Baldur's Gate. Trust me. What do I do for some salt? Wait, you're a merchant. You've had your share. Leave some for the rest. How, I Starion! Oh! <laughs> no time to rest. I recognize that voice. Ah, uh, if it isn't the talk of the camp. It's a rare day when I see one of you lot about. Thank goodness you came along when you... Oh! Oh. There isn't a bit of color in those cheeks, Petal. Are you harsh, cold, feverish? Auntie Ethel will sort you out. I've lotions and potions galore. I think I've heard about you. Hmm. Are you an alchemist? I'll let her fuss over me. Aha! You take a sip of that, and you'll feel right as rain, sweetie. I don't believe you. Hmm, what is it exactly? Oh, it is just a healing potion. Nothing fancy. Here. I don't believe you. You're not going to drink it, are you? It look like you might need a pick-me-up. I'm sorry to go on about it, but are you all right? You're looking awful peaky. Hmm.
It's difficult to explain. Oh, I've seen it all. Have you? I once had a fella who'd been caught dabbling with a dryad. Ah. The wife was none too pleased and introduced him to a pot of boiling oil. Ooh. But worry not. I fixed him up, and depending on the lighting, he looks good as new. <laughs> My point is, whatever ails you, I promise I've seen worse. Something doesn't add up about this one. Don't tell her anything. I completely what agree. What is it, Petal? What's wrong? Well, can't say that's a concern of yours. Don't get your knickers in a twist. I was only asking. Now, do you need anything? I have a few odds and ends for sale. What harm? Hey, bother. A few odds and ends, hmm? Ooh, a potion of greater healing. Did you really give me a potion of greater healing? Wow. Uh, for those who don't know, I'm not going to spoil who she is, but we'll just say Shadowheart is onto something. Wait, what's this? No. Uh, let me offload the rest of my junk to her. Take care now, sweetie. Oh, yeah. You too. I'm sure we'll meet again soon. Never wanted the easy path. Okay, now if I want to rob all of these characters blind, I think I have to do a little bit of creative maneuvering. It's more important to rob, to rob, excuse me, Auntie Ethel blind. Uh, Shanahar is technically in this discussion, so I don't know if I can get guidance. Can I pull her out? Yes, fantastic. Give me no target. Starring is not that good at stealth. Exposed now. What? Fifteen? Oh, is this because... Oh, wow. Hmm. That, um... It's a little tricky, isn't it? I'll give it a shot, though. Boom. What a generous pocket. Step carefully. Unbelievable. Quick step. All right. That'll do. Thank you. Um. That. Uh, I'm not hungry. Suit yourself. Great. Yeah. A knoll. Hmm. Doesn't taste half bad. Nothing for now. Nothing for now. I don't think I have to tell her, right? Don't waste a step. Those who know. <laughs> I don't think I have to. Oh, wait a minute. You're a traitor as well. Thanks for fighting off those goblins. If you need to replace any gear, just ask. My oh. selection is pretty slim. I had to leave most of my equipment in Elturel. And where's Elturel? <laughs> the forge is holding on by a... Yeah, sure. Ooh, hello? Heavy crossbow. Ooh. Ooh, I sense more thievery in my immediate future. Trust no one. <clears throat> I definitely wasn't caught. <laughs> but uh, I have relieved the blacksmith from a few of his items, such as the Warhammer for Shadowheart, a heavy crossbow for Lazelle, the rapier for moi. Can I do a wield? Not the rapier. Okay, that's fine. And we have this for Hunter's Mark as well, but I don't know who I should give that to. How are we doing? Have you guys calmed down yet? Shoes. Where are my boots? No. I think I was caught by a um, guard have seen of all things. But anyway. I wonder what the next move is. Are you also a thief? Goblins, druids. This grove is a death trap. Grab what you can and get out. That's my advice. Fair enough. All right. Should mind my step. Now let's go see what this goblin knows. This goblin. I'm gonna bite the heads off you. You pointed you the crossbow at it. Me. Your hands are shaking. Put it down. She can't fight back. That's the point. Ha. Get out of the way. She didn't kill your brother, Arca. 
You're better than this. I'm not. Shoot before you lose your nerve, Tieflin. If you ever had it to begin with. Hmm. I mean, I'm interested in learning a few things. Those words could be your last. I'm not afraid. Chosen by the Absolute, I am. I'm blessed. Withers also I'm spoke about the Absolute. Right. Yeah. What happens? Here it comes, you little beast. Oh. Okay. Nice shot. That goblin won't be the last. Nope. But I have a trick. I'm sorry, what? There she is. I have questions, and I'm a necromancer. The corpse regards you lifelessly. So, <clears throat> who or what is the absolute? Everything. All of us. Not helpful. How did they capture you? Scouting. Snooping. Tieflings. Don't fight. Fair. That's rich coming from a goblin. Who leads your tribe? Boss Ragslin. And the drow. A drow? Hmm. Who are you? Cesar. Toughest in the tribe. Yeah, okay. Can anyone in your tribe heal? Priestess Gut. Powerful. Hmm. The spell's power wanes. You can ask no more questions. Okay. Should have asked where the treasure was instead of who are you. Ooh, I'm inspired. Of course I am. Hey, Starion. Watch your back. Abre la puerta. Let's crack it open. Sorry, what? Can't. You mean I can't reach it? It's right. Oh, what's even in here? Fine. If I can't reach it, I'll just go the other way. Oh. Mm. Surprise! There are mushrooms here. Well, a party member has died. Use the scroll of Revivify to bring them back. Guide me. Enough waiting. I crave blood. I should have been a little bit more careful. Thankfully, everyone has one scroll of Revivify. Come back. That nearly ended me. Shadowheart is inspired. Cool. Yeah, I'm sorry, Astarian. Um. Oh, rested enough. Now, forward. We'll have to be a little bit more careful. Ooh, hi. So it's fine as long as we don't step near it, right? Oh. Okay. That was terrifying. Alrighty. I almost broke this burlap sack with a rotten carrot. Oh, the tragedy. Could you imagine? This isn't highlighting stuff. Could you imagine the horror? Excuse me. Let's break it. If I couldn't loot a rotten carrot, I just picked up a cooking pot. How... Was that it? Was... Did I come here for a cooking pot? Uh... Step quick. How for a skeleton key? Why is this so tough to open? It's a rusted locked door. Uh-oh. I think I failed. I won! Should have had a Shadow Heart here. 
Oh! I found another exploding thing. <laughs> oh, okay, a natural 20. Okay, I see. Fuck you. Good. What was the point of that? <laughs> anyway. Oh, is that where your equipment goes if you get sent to... Oh, that's if you get sent to prison. Ah. Uh, My face protects me. I got it. I understand now. I was so confused. I've never been thrown in prison in this game. All right. I'm at an hour, over an hour of recording, and I haven't even oh, spoken with the cool. druids. Done. Done. Ugh. I guess I'm just swear that ox's gaze is following me. A strange ox. Hello. <laughs> the beast, the ox, makes you uneasy. Try to discern why. Okay. Let's discern why. Easy peasy. Something's off. This creature isn't what it appears to be. Okay. <laughs> That, hmm. All right, what do I do about, what do I do with this piece of knowledge that I've been provided? I kid, I'm not gonna talk to you. Hi. I need to at least talk to the druids today, okay? Please, last through. Oh, there's some sort of um, blockade. Let my daughter go right now. She's a thief, hell spawn. And you will wait for Korga's judgment. Now get back! Oh, let me through, Mradrasheb, or I'll rip your damn throat out! I think he's offering to do that for you. Well, okay. So, uh, what's that about? Should I talk to the tieflings? We could have taken those guards. Could have? Discussion. You sure? We need to get Arabella out. Now! You heard the guards. They're waiting on Corker to give word. I'd sooner trek through the nine hells than trust that snake! Ugh. Um. Uh, why are the druids holding your daughter? Arabella tried to steal their idol. Druids lost their damn minds about it. They need it for their precious ritual. Ooh. Oh, it's all my fault. I told her I wished the wretched thing would just disappear, or better yet, explode. Now Arabella's being judged by a bunch of druids who hate us. That's not right. Hmm. Breaking into druid chambers to steal a sacred relic. Oh, she sounds like fun. I agree. Hmm. You've got your work cut out for you. Figure something out. We always do. Speaking of, we don't have time to gather. You'd best move on. Okay. Try greasing palms. These things. Hey are... guys. <sighs> yes, yes, I know you're a big scary bear. Come, Magrin, give him a chance. You step back. We'll not tolerate drow in here. I will shank you. <clears throat> if it weren't for me, you'd be overrun by goblins by now. I will go where I please. Keep back. Force my hand and I'll show you its claws. A moment, Giona. What? Oh, I understand. How is that whispering? You're you. like three feet tall. Apparently, Korga wants to see you. Go ahead. Great. Thanks. How dare you bring my race into this? Hello! Ah, my good friend! Do I know you? You were at the gates just now, no? When the goblins came? You saw them up close? Most certainly. A few questions, if you please. There's no overstating my interest. Okay. Happy to help. Glory. Now then. Mm hmm How would you describe that particular batch of goblins? Uh, size? 
nature, distinguishing qualities. You search your mind, successfully recalling various details of goblin behavior. Well, give an exact description. Goblins were of a rare gem-colored hue and wielded magic blowguns. That is and not what I either. said. This man has no respect for truth. And the dragon they had marching in the rear, was it of the brass or silver variety? There was no dragon. Witnesses failed to notice the obvious dragon. I don't like you. Last question, then you'll be quite free. Did the attackers rally to the absolute when they fell upon the gates? Hmm. Did they mention? Yeah, sure. They did, didn't they? Oh, oh, curious. Oh, curious indeed. I've interrogated one. A captive in this very camp. Yeah. She reports they've abandoned their god, Maglaviet, in favor of someone called the Absolute. I interrogated her too. From the grave. Uh, hold your tongue. Never you mind. I'm on my way to their camp as we speak. I always knew my studies in Gukliak would come to some use. Uh, about our conversation earlier, why the dragon? My friend, every story benefits from a dragon. Yeah, a story. But we are living in reality right now. And those who fabricate... Oh, the countenance of history Would that are scum. Really, my Ursheim friend. Ooh. Alas, I've never learned to converse with your kind. The Autumn Crocus. I have one potion of animal speaking. I need to be very careful where I use it. Unless I can find more. I like I'm just walking in and robbing this person's herb garden. Ooh, a shiny key. You saw that, right? Ahem. <clears throat> Huh? You're testing my patience. Hmm. I'll go this way. <clears throat> no one stopped me yet. Very well. Hey, Fabe, can you talk to this bird? Shit. Careful, I bite. Who's here? Oh, the lady. Fine, I'll try later. No one back home. I had more important things to do. Who are you? Speak. I just stole you from your herb garden. Uh, what are you saying for the herb? The, the bird. bird knows. She needs to know. You do not. How unfortunate. If okay. not over, then through. I felt like there was no need to talk about that. Well, friends, we'll end here today on this meeting the leader of these so called druids. Now, of course, I feel for the refugees. Please. I'm sorry. I feel for the kid. This is madness, Korga. She's just a... A what, Wrath? A thief? A poison? A threat? But I also don't care. I will imprison the devil. And I will cast out every stranger. One of your guards said you wanted to see me. Here I am. We will speak soon enough. First, judgment must be passed. The parasite eats our food, drinks our water, then steals our most holy idol in thanks. Wrath, lock her up. She remains here until the rite is complete. And keep still, devil. Tila is restless. Come, Koga. We took back the idol. Surely... Do it. Hmm. So... We could do a nature check. Oh, I have an intelligence. Oh, I have to make the intelligence check. All right. Don't druids cherish harmony? Jailing the girl disrupts. I, I'm mocking this, but I suppose in a way I would appreciate balance of sorts. All right, give it to me. Let's go. Oh, shit. I have to roll really high here. One. 
Inspiration. This is an inspiration moment. Do it. Let's go. You're joking. Oh, yes. Thank you, Shadow Hearts. I hear the Tree Father's spirit in your words. Fuck the it Tree Father. Sivisif, Tila to me. Out, thief. My grace has its limits. <sighs> it hurts. Are you okay? Thank you, Korga. Master Halsin was- Halsin isn't here. Keep his name off your tongue, lest Tila pierce it. I sense... I sense danger. You okay, Shadowheart? I know that look. You're wondering why I was in pain before. Let's just clear the air about that now. It's just an old wound that hurts me from time to time. Nothing to be concerned about. Are you it's sure? Nothing to do with the tadpoles, at least. In case your imagination is in danger of getting away from you. It's just something I have to live with. How badly does it hurt? Quite a lot, if I'm being honest. But it always passes quickly, so I can manage. Okay. Are you positive it's not connected to the tadpoles? Positive. You can trust me on that. Okay. Fair enough. So Shadowheart liked that, but Lazal did not. I'm actually curious why she did like that. Can't afford to stay idle. Oh, action, not reaction. Let's get on with it. Ah. What? A frightening save? What? Who tried to frighten you? Still alive. Is there like frightening aura so in this game? Grass. Hey, Kaga. Let's chat about this ritual, because I have feelings. Go on. Say it. You think I'm a monster? I don't not think you're a monster. <laughs> you're protecting your own. Sometimes cruelty is required. I'm clicking this mostly because I know who's going to like this. First you urge grace. Then you speak truth. You surprised me twice. But ever. I also understand. However... It's a shame the grace period ends. The viper's fangs have been bared. She must guard her brood. No matter. I took back the idol of Sylvanus, and the rite is resumed. We will seal the grove, free from harm, free of intruders. Now, I believe that... I, I've been right so far. Like, I agree with what I've said so far, as much as I may have mocked it. But I think... Let's see. This right must be born of powerful magics. The right of thorns. It is the Tree Father's gift that none come to harm. When we speak the final prayer, the great vine will sprout forth. The grove will be cloaked in bramble and thorn. No one enters, no one leaves. Sanctuary. Prison. Stagnation. None of this can happen while outlanders infect us. Sylvanus demands that we choke them out. Also, any gift from the gods doubles as a curse. And this curse, as mentioned, is stagnation. Hmm. I didn't really come on Zephyr's behalf. I could reach for my weapon. It is none of my concern. Oh, God damn it! Do what you want. So you say. Yet the child walks free. You showed great metal at the gate. The metal of a skilled sword for hire. I want you to provide your services to Sevlor. Offer to guide the Outlanders out of the grove. I'm sure they'll reward you well. They're to be gone before final prayer. If they are not, the Viper must strike. Well, I mean, prattle all you want. The refugees aren't my concern. Then they soon know the sting of my venom. Get out. We have no more business. Mm, no, I don't think I will. Need to find a way forward. Because if I were a guessing individual, there's... Oh, hey, Fendal. Oh, my savior. 
I wish you could have visited in better times. I want blood on my hands. We have the right to defend our home. So that's what you want? To kill a bunch of innocents? I don't want to kill anyone. Why is that I red? Let this grove be hard. Mural, Not again. They look like dark justices. What? Oh. Dark justices. Darkest hour, a concord made, twixt harp and wild against the shade. Harp and wild? You recall stories of an alliance between druids and the harpers, but the details are vague. Hmm. I think there's a faction in... Wait a minute. Uh, a faction in the Act 2 that's that are, that are called Harpers. I don't know much about Act 2. Please don't spoil anything. I just know what they showed off at the last Hell panel. Or panel from Hell or whatever it's called. I like how this isn't stealing. Just yoink, yoink. All right, we're here. Well... Uh, the second reason we were here, you know, an hour and 20 minutes in, is to speak with Nettie. I see you. Just give me a moment. Uh, this medicatrix. There. It's up to her now. Life or death. Now, what was it you needed? I'm looking for n healing. I do what I can. For most folks, that's enough. Come here. Let's have a look at you. Seems like it won't be enough for me. You seem healthy enough. A bit tired around the eyes, maybe. Hmm. <laughs> More... No good way of putting this. I, uh, have a tadpole in my head. A tadpole? A mind flare tadpole. What other kinds are there? <laughs> Not like a frog off in my eye. That's a serious condition. Come, follow me. I might be able to help. You don't sound confident. We need to be quick. This way. Ooh. Nettie's glove. How'd you open that? There's another stone slab I don't know how to open, and I... Head on in. Uh-oh. I don't like that. I'm also just now remembering how this goes. This one goes. had the same problem as you. Attacked us in the woods together with some goblins. Tadpole crawled out of his head soon after. Hmm. Well... Half drow. Really? He and I have some kind of parasite. Seems so. Gave Master Halson a right start. I am suspicious. It's why he joined the adventurers on their expedition. To find out what was happening. I pity you got me instead of him. He understands these things. Studied them. Still, we have options. Do we? All right. Let's see what we can do. Well, what's the plan? Will it help? She shifts uneasily, hesitating. Something's off. Thank you, Inside Check. Right. But first things first. Tell me about your symptoms. Have you noticed anything strange happening? The strange thing is that nothing has happened. Hmm. It might. I don't need to divulge all this. It might. What aren't you telling me? I'm telling you everything you need to know. Believe me on that. I want to help you. But I can't unless you work with me. So, has anything unusual happened to you? I fell from a ship in the sky, but something caught me. It saved my life. Protected from on high. Sounds like the drow. Master Halson said he was tougher than he had any right to be. How'd you pick up the parasite? Halson was desperate to find where all this was happening. Oh. 
on a mind flare ship. I was kidnapped and infected. A mind flare ship? But Master Halson was sure. What is Look, that noise? You've been straight with me, so I'll be straight with you. You're dangerous. If you transform here, we're all dead. But you seem like a good soul. You deserve a chance to save yourself. I was about to threaten to shank you, so... This is a vial of wyvern poison. Swear to me, you'll swallow it if you feel any symptoms. Uh, what about that branch of yours? The thorn? Coated in a fatal toxin. Ha! <laughs> it was a last resort, in case I couldn't trust you. Shocker. I don't have a cure. Only a way out. I'm sorry for misleading you. But I had to be sure you weren't a threat before I told you everything. I kind of understand. Now, do I have your word or not? Yeah, sure. Wyvern poison's pretty rare. All right. Swear it. On what? Fine. I hope it doesn't come to that. But thank you. Here. Astarian disapproves, but the ladies you know, approve. I've spent my life treating folk and never once saw a mind flare infection. Then suddenly, there's dozens of you. Maybe more. Master Halson and I were tracking them, studying them. The door just opens. Trying to figure out what the hell was going on. Because you should all be changing. There should be a small army of mind flayers out there. But you're not. Weird powers aside, you seem perfectly normal. Hmm. You must have learned something from studying them. For one... That thing in your head is like nothing we've ever seen from Mind Flayers. It's one of their worms for sure. But this one gives you powers. Telepathic connections. And it doesn't turn you into one of them. Not yet, anyhow. Hmm. So, you think it's only a matter of time? Could be. But there's a lot we don't know. Infected. Folks like you have been converging on an old temple of Saluna. And I've no idea why. When Master Halson heard the adventurers were heading that way, he saw a chance to get answers. Joined on the spot. Whatever he found there, he didn't make it back. Hmm. You think he's still alive? I think so. I hope so. I've sent birds to find him, but they can't get close without goblins trying to shoot them down. You, though, you're one of them. Technically speaking, I mean. They won't kill someone carrying their parasite. If you can find Halson and get him out of there, we can discover what he learned. And perhaps he can save your life. How's that sound? Hmm. All right, I think this is an interesting lead. All right. Thank you. It would mean everything to the Grove. To me. I wish I could tell you more. But only those adventurers know what happened out there. The ones that left? I think they all left. All I can say for sure is they all went to the old temple of Saluna. And Master Halson didn't make it back. Good luck out there. And if things start to go bad, remember the vial. Remember your oath. Oh, yeah. One step at a time, Nettie. Come on. There's something in that vessel. Take a closer look. What? Than ceramorphosis, nonetheless. What just spoke to me? Better than becoming a mind flayer. Keep it in case things start to go bad. What? Track the druid, find whatever burrow he runs to, and report back to me. Remember, you are only a scout. Do not engage, do not kill anyone. Simply observe and return. I shall decide what we do next. M. In that vessel. It's glowing. Am I supposed to do something with this? I have pointed at it. What am I supposed to do? I don't know. I've taken all I can from it. Perhaps it's just telling me about the... Um... If I kill Nettie... Does all of this stop being stealing?
Rune of the Elk. Wait, it's a puzzle. Oh, no. Uh. Okay. Let's just reset it. Oh, dear. I, I think I need slot. an item. But no rune. Yeah. I need to go find something. We'll find it. Don't worry. I'm debating whether I finish everything in this place today. We just let her run off. She's a child. A devil child. What or a picture of Los. No way. Yet she failed. That's what matters. This is uh Losa from Divinity Original Sin 2. A nice little Easter egg. She sings you a lovely song if you follow her story. On antidotes. Why is this green? Salts of Mugwort, suspension of Bullywork Trumpet. No, don't go there. Oh, I got a recipe. Oh, that's nice. Hey, do you have something on you? I bet she does. I bet that's where it is. That's gonna pass. Neutralizes all effects of poison. Madness. Good berry. She doesn't. Probably in a chest then. Oh, I'm gonna get so lost looking for it. Mm. Over there. I really should have just killed everyone. I've never done that before. But I could have. Ooh, the Rite of Thorns. Servant's Quarter. Oh, that's suspicious. That's crazy suspicious. Everyone get over here. Dull moment. Moving ahead. Ooh, and let's read about the right. Okay, is this not stealing? Okay. Let's read about this. Interwoven prayers and incantations sneak across one side of the page. Oh. When the prayer is complete, thorns and bramble rise in the earth, protecting from all from a harm. I got experience with that. Trust no one. One step at a time. Hello. On the hunt. Oh. I Is bet one of the not? keys that we have go with us. No. Never mind. Another step forward. Excuse me. Quietly. The starring and will shank you though. What will the tieflings want next? Letting the hell child go. Can't risk being in open view. Locked. What? Time to press ahead. How delicious. Did one of the keys not do it? Ah, that's fine. Wits and blades always shop. I'll just do it the old-fashioned way. Someone there. With pleasure. Beautiful. Okay. I got a four on guidance as well. A seventeen from what a three. GG, Nori. Oh, a half-torn note. I'm looking for a glyph, though, and I'm not finding it. The marks crisscrossing this page don't look scribed so much as slashed. Kaga, Swamp Ducks, Tree, Meet Me Alone, Oladon. Who's Oladon? Hmm. I expect something fishy. Can't afford to stay idle. Looking ahead. Get it, because it's a swamp? How much further can I go? Grove Artifacts. <laughs> Did I just yeet something? Oh, a register of druidic relics. Alright, well, I don't know where this is. But I'm not opposed to keep looking. I remember there was like a... A small silver box somewhere. What's this say? The towers seized the battle done. The moonrise broke the darkest one. You recognize the mark of the dark goddess Shah on the broken helmet. This army marched in her name. So many dead. Sent to the Night Singer's embrace. 
Moonrise must be a reference to Shah's divine sister, Saluna. Hmm. I don't want to kill anyone, but I won't let this grove be harmed. Not again. What level are you? Level five. Huh? Come, boy. It's all right. Got something to hide? No, no, no. I wasn't gonna try and pickpocket you. Not be cursed. I wouldn't do that. By claw and tooth, from root to thorn, the old oak's grove to wildlings sworn. The mural shows druids claiming the grove in the name of the old oak, Sylvanus, god of nature. Mm. Breathe deep and move. The forest rose with claw and tooth to tear the darkness from its roots. The mural depicts druid and beast fighting together to drive monsters from their land. It looks like they were victorious. And yet, the monsters have returned. It's true. Oh! I got a sage thing. Nice. Why can I go up here? Hmm. There's a lot I still want to explore, but... I think that's going to be it for today. That seems like a good place as any to stop. We've made it to the druids. We've learned what their plan is. And I don't particularly like it. I thought about shanking a few people, but I refrained for now. <laughs> for now. We have our hints on where to go next. And next time, we may begin acting upon them. Thank you all for watching. I hope that you enjoyed. Thank you to the patrons and the channel members who support the channel. I greatly appreciate you. If if you'd like to stay updated on the Happy Channel, feel free to join the Discord description down below. And I will see you next time for a little bit more exploration in the Druid's Grove, but to set out to see if we can learn a bit more about the thing inside our heads. Bye!